What is up, guys? Welcome to Integra Vlog number 22? 22. That sounds right. Not gonna be doing much, really. I made up a little to do list on what I will be doing today fixing a little fuel leak. Um, I guess it's something to do with gas. Probably. This is my own little theory. Something. My leak comes and goes, and it will. My gas will leak through the threads on my fuel pressure regulator. Um, sometimes it doesn't, sometimes it does. I think whenever the gas heats up more, it can probably seep through the threads, maybe. Some type of science stuff like that. So, um, I bought some thread sealant tape stuff that I probably should have put on in the first place. I thought I could get away with not using it, but yeah, use that sealant tape if you're working with any threads and gasoline. So I'm going to be fixing that fuel leak. I should say fuel leaks. Um, overall, I want to clean up the Integra inside and out, make it look, you know, all pretty and stuff. I kind of want to inspect around my car. It's something I do often because, well, let's face it, it's a Honda. If you don't keep up with them, they will burn you to the ground almost quite literally. Keep up with your Honda and you'll be happy. So, yeah, I'm just going to inspect around because you never know what problems I could have. I also want to clean up my brakes because they like to make noise and kind of get stuck because I need a brake change. I'm, I need new calipers, rotors, brake pads, just, I want a completely new setup, which will be coming soon, eventually. I also still need that upper camber kit to control my camber. I also need a rear camber kit as well. Um, but that's for the near future, along with lower ball joints, because my front lower ball joints are completely blown out. But, it's fine. <laughs> it's my fault for getting cheap ball joints, I guess. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. I have done some things to the Integra since the last update, and that would be more horsepower because of more decals. So here's our first upgrade. Looky there. That's about 50 horsepower right there. But, I decided to go twin decal and get another one here. So that's about a hundred horsepower gain, easy. Now don't forget about the ones I already have in here, that Rising Sun, that adds about 200 because it has all the JDMs. And then that, but did you die sticker? I'd say that's about 50, just because it's kind of cool, kind of funny. And of course, you know all the gold I got behind my car, my subframe brace and all that, that adds an easy 250 horsepower. Don't forget about the taggy tag. That's about a good solid 50. That's about a 75 horsepower gain. Another 75 right there. That quick release over there, that's an easy 100. Another 50 horsepower. So that's, uh, I can't do the math. Let's just say we're getting to like a thousand. Now my biggest upgrade is this fancy gauge I just installed. That easily adds like 200 horsepower and it looks super cool. Here's going to be our next 150 horsepower gain right here. In Japanese it says blessed. I hope. We're going for all the horsepowers here man. I'm going to be about 1000 horsepower by the time I'm done with this. Better watch out. But yeah, I put on a couple more decals. Actually a few, but one of them I took off because it just didn't stay on right and I put it on a little crooked So I just took it off. Also before that I uh, Installed a little Which we call it Those little single gauge pillars and I added a gauge obviously in my car uh, a fuel pressure gauge a digital fuel pressure gauge with a sensor so I pretty much replaced this gauge which I deemed a little fault, faulty it was not exactly uh, giving me a precise reading not as good as this one with the actual sensor I'm gonna go ahead and pull up my car and do some stuff to it yeah there's my sensor there just 
tucks right up into there. All nicely. Where I'm leaking from mostly is like back here. I'm not exactly sure where, but just to be safe, every single thread on here is gonna get taped. Here's the tape I'm talking about, in case you don't know. It's like a plumber's tape or whatever you wanna call it. I also added something else to the list. I need to check my camber. With what? With my new tool I got. This thing's pretty awesome, and I haven't even used it yet. Well, not on my car at least. It's super neat. It's like 12 bucks. Also, another thing I did, forgot to call it out, I painted my intake so it looks way cleaner in here now. That really just, I never realized how ugly it was till I fixed it up. Who'd that be? Chance is here! Chance is here! And we're going to a car meet or something like that. I'm gonna cruise with Mackenzie. Just got some coffee. We're about to meet up, Mackenzie, at the Dagum Circle K. Okay? So let's go ahead and do that. Keep the new gauge. Only got two minutes of time to record, so I'm gonna try to make it worth it. 270. Uh, like a supercharger. This thing's clean, dude. Yes. Yes. I'm glad we attended. <laughs> Bro. Ooh. Well, all right. Is that an FD that just showed up to a Lake City meme? I ran someone on the interstate. It was a fucking... Uh
Another dig ahead of us? I think so. You gonna go again? I'm playing with two minutes of record time here. I'm almost out of memory, so I'm trying to savor every bit. State trooper just passed, just kept driving. No fucks given. Right? No fucks given. That sounds so beautiful. I didn't catch it, but he just went. Damn, you didn't catch it. I didn't catch it. It didn't record fast enough. Uh, you didn't get it. No. Oh. <laughs> Cop just came. He <laughs> said, "Nobody's street racing, right?" No. Too bad I didn't film it, but oh well. Everything's starting to kind of uh, chill out here, so I guess we're gonna head back home. Yes, this was very cool. We gotta start coming here every week. People who come to these meets every week make a car meet a uh, actual an actual good car meet so support your local car meets just by showing up right what support your local car meets just by showing up right yes yes indeed i wish i would have got more footage i mean i've been i've been scavenging like two or three minutes of footage so yeah i had to delete a lot of clips out of this vlog but oh well I think here soon everyone's gonna start heading out. I'd like to capture a flyby of everyone leaving, yeah, but. Mackenzie's got a quick car, dude. That surprised me. He's light, he's got the torque and horsepower. He's got the light wheels. <laughs> That's it, folks. Alright, guys, that looks like it's about it for Integra Vlog number 22. Thank you guys so much for watching, especially if you watched the video all the way through. Any subscribers, comments, likes, dislikes, shares, whatever the case. Anything helps. Any feedback, any type of support, whatever. I appreciate it greatly. Um, once again, thanks for watching, guys. Stay tuned for more material. Hopefully, these local meets keep on growing and keep getting more awesome. Like I said earlier, it it takes people to make a good meet. You gotta, even if you don't got some crazy car, or even if you do got a crazy car, you showing up just helps you know it builds that community that much more that's why i want to start going to these meets a lot more um like i said thanks for watching guys stay tuned for more material peace